Hey guys, what's up? Stephen here with Pro 11 Games, and here's another video on how to create regular shapes in Roblox Studio without plugins and without uh, meshes and Blender or any plugins. So, um, if you haven't watched our Union and Negate Function tutorials, the link is pasted on the description below. You can watch it if you don't know how to use it yet because we're gonna use it to create our shape for today which is an s shape or curves so let's hop onto it so what we need first is a sphere or sorry uh, a cylinder so what once we have the cylinder you can uh, design whatever you want to do with it uh, but we would need to set it to like this oops yep to large I guess so let's me to since uh and then I'll just change this to alright so you can design it whatever you prefer and then what we need to do after the cylinder or the flat sphere is a block because we would need this to cut the uh, cylinder in half or the this one this flat sphere in half we're gonna use this so we're just gonna use the negate function to make it half all right so negate and then highlight and then union once once the cylinder is half, you you would have to duplicate it and then move it further to outside of the cut part and then you would have to use the gate again and highlight it and union. So you would have this shape. It's already a curve but for you to like do an S or make some more curves with it you can copy it or you can duplicate it and then rotate it like this you if you want this to be much larger the this lens you can uh, minimize the let's do it uh, Alright, you can minimize this. Oops, the other one's highlighted, so you can just minimize this. So, yeah, like that. Then move it to the center, and it would cut those parts. So, what we have to do is we're gonna lower it down a bit, and then create another one and move it upwards so that we we have to click this and these two parts we will do the negate and then click this one for the union so it's gonna be much uh, wider so let's duplicate it again and then rotate it and then adjust it this all right so we have our s shape now this is useful for if you want to have it on your OV or you want to make a big road or or like elevated road you can use this um, if you don't want to use the terrain you can use this all right I hope you learned something on this video and if you have any comments comment down below and if you want to us to do a tutorial on a shape you have not you can imagine but have not yet or you don't know how to make it comment down below and we'll make a tutorial for you like and subscribe don't forget that and catch you on another video bye bye